texturing walls is a great way to cover minor surface imperfections and give your walls a unique look. Today, we're going to show you how to apply a textured finish to drywall with a broad knife. This process is commonly known as skip trowel, as it allows the texture to skip on the walls without dragging your knuckles through the texture. Before you start, remember that USG Sheetrock brand First Coat Primer or an interior flat latex drywall primer with high pigment solids should be applied to a clean wall. For new drywall, the purpose of the prime coat is to minimize decorating problems by equalizing the porosity and texture differences between the drywall face paper and the areas covered with joint compound. It's important to apply a full coverage coat. Roll the primer on, let it soak in for a minute, and then apply additional primer to achieve a consistent, even coat. Let the prime coat dry before texturing. Start by mixing your texture compound. If using powder, first add in the range of four to five gallons of water per 50 pound bag. Then add small amounts of water to the compound until you reach a consistency that resembles cake batter. Next, pour the compound into a mud pan. Pick up some texture compound with the leading edge of the broad knife. The texture should be across the whole knife blade edge. Gently place the knife against the wall and pull with little to no pressure. This will cause the compound to skip across the wall. It'll take a little practice to get the pattern you want. Applying the texture in a random pattern is preferred because of the inconsistent pattern created. One directional patterns look very nice if applied by a pro, but it'll be frustrating for a beginner to achieve consistent results. Additionally, one directional patterns are much harder to repair. Now here's a quick tip. You should test the skip trowel pattern in an inconspicuous area to ensure you have the correct texture consistency for the pattern you're trying to achieve. Let the texture set up for a few minutes, then gently wipe across it again with a clean broad knife to knock it down. Be sure to maintain a consistent thickness as you apply. Continue in this manner until the walls have been completed. Allow the texture to dry completely overnight. By following these simple tips and tricks for applying drywall texture by hand, you're sure to get a long-lasting and unique interior surface.